Okay, here's our equation for uh, hyperbola. And notice for hyperbola, uh, what matters is does the x square or the y square comes first? So is it a y square minus x square type of situation or an x square minus y square? Well, clearly this is a y square minus x square. So that's why on the, the conic section sheet that I gave you under parabolas, that's on the right side y squared minus x squared type of equation, right? So the formulas under that, uh, well, actually it doesn't matter for all we're finding is the transverse axis. And it's the same formula no matter if the x squared comes first or the y squared. But, but for the vertices and the foci and the asymptotes, those are different formulas depending on what comes first. But here it's pretty simple. We can see here a squared is 64, and therefore the square root of 64 is 8. So the length of the transverse axis is 2 times 8, which is 16. So how does that fit in? Well, because the y squared comes first, this opens up and down. And this distance right here is 8. This 8 and this 8 add up to a total distance of 16.